Today we are working chest and biceps. You'll need a set of dumbbells for today's workout. When you're ready, let's get started. Grab your dumbbells for the chest press. Lay back on the floor, feet on the floor, arms out wide. Lower back presses to the floor. Let's go, press it up. One, lots of control. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Two more. Last one. Nice job. Bring your weights in. Drop your weights. Roll it up. We're going to take a quick break here, but hit pause if you'd like a little bit longer break. When you're ready, we're going to grab those dumbbells, lay back on the floor, arms out wide, lower back presses to the floor, really squeeze your abs. Let's go. Take it up. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, two more. Last one. Nice job. Bring your weights down. Drop your weights. Roll it up. We're going to take another break here. Make sure you take enough of a rest. And when you're ready, we're going to do that one more time. So grab those dumbbells. Let's lay back on the floor, arms out wide, lower back, presses to the floor. Let's go, press it up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, two more. Last one. Nice job. Bring your weights down. Drop your weights. Roll it up. And rest it out. Standing up nice and tall for the bicep curl. Turn your hand so the back of your hand is facing your quad. Elbows are pinned to your side. Abs are tight, but is squeezed. Let's curl. Take it up. One. Squeezing at the top. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Two more. Last one. Nice job. Let's rest it out. Take a break here. When you're ready, we're going to do it again. So standing up nice and tall, shoulders are pulled back, abs are tight, butt is squeezed. Back of your hand faces your quad. Let's go. Keep those elbows in. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, two more. Last one. Nice job. Let's rest it out. We're going to do that one more time through. Let those arms recover. And when you're ready, let's do it again. Standing up nice and tall. Abs are tight, butt is squeezed. Back of your hand faces your quads. Let's go. Up and squeeze. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven. Eight. Two more. Last one. Nice job, and rest it out.
Let's lay back on the floor for the rotating chest press. So grab your weights, arms out wide, lower back presses to the floor. Now as we press up, we're gonna rotate the weight so they meet in the center, then we'll rotate again as we come back down. Let's go. Up and rotate, rotate, bring it down. There's one. Two, lower back, pressing to the floor. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Two more. Last one. Bring it all the way down. Drop your weights. Roll it up. Take a break here, so rest it out. When you're ready, we're gonna do it again. So grab those dumbbells. Let's lay back on the floor. Arms out wide, lower back, pressing to the floor. Remember, up and rotate, let's go. Rotate, rotate, bring it down. There's one. Two. Three. Four, keeping those abs nice and tight. Five, six, seven, eight, nine. One more, bring it down. Nice job, drop your weights, roll it up. We're gonna take another break here. So we gotta do that one more time. So when you're ready, Grab your dumbbells, lay back on the floor. Arms out wide, lower back presses to the floor. Let's go, up and rotate, rotate, bring it down, there's one. Two, three, four, five, Eight, two more. Last one, bring it all the way down. Drop your weights, roll it up, and rest it out. Standing up nice and tall, shoulders pulled back, abs are tight. We're gonna point these dumbbells up to the ceiling as we curl. Let's go. Keep those elbows in by your side. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, two more. Last one, nice job. Let's rest it out. Take a break here. When you're ready, we're gonna do it again. Standing up tall, shoulders pulled back, elbows by your side. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, Six, lots of control. Seven, eight, two more. Last one. Nice job, let's rest it out. Take a deep breath, shake out your arms. We're gonna do that one more time through. So when you're ready, standing up tall, shoulders pulled back, abs are tight. Elbows are pinned to your side. Let's go. Up and squeeze and down. There's two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Two more. Last one. Nice 
jab and rest it out. For the decline chest press, we're going to create our own decline with our body. But first, let's grab those dumbbells, lay back on the floor. Feet on the floor, arms out wide. Now we're going to lift our hips up off the floor. Abs are going to be super tight to create that decline. So let's lift our hips, squeeze in your butt the whole time. We're going to be working your butt as well here. Let's go. Press it up. One. Two, keep squeezing your butt. Three, four, abs are tight. Five, six, seven, eight. Two more. Last one. Bring your weights down, lower your butt, drop your weights, roll it up. We're gonna take a break here. Remember, take enough of a break, hip pause. Take your break, come back when you're ready. When you're ready, we're gonna do it again. So grab your dumbbells, let's lay back on the floor, arms out wide, lift your hips up off the floor, abs are tight, squeeze your butt. Let's go, press it up. One, two, three, four, Five, six, seven, eight, two more. Last one, press it up, bring your weights down, lower your butt, drop your weights, roll it up. Let's take a break here. We gotta do that one more time through, but first, take your break. I know your arms are getting tired. I want you to rest a bit. And when you're ready, let's do it again. Grab your weights, lay back on the floor. Arms out wide, abs are tight. Lift your hips off the floor, squeeze your butt. Let's go, press it up. One, two, three, four, five, six, Seven, eight, two more. Last one. Bring your weights down. Lower your butt. Drop your weights. Roll it up. And rest it out. For the bicep curl with a hold. Only one arm will be moving at a time, but both arms are working incredibly hard. So the arm that's not moving will be in an isometric hold. The goal here is to not let this arm slide down. We want to keep it parallel to the floor at all times. I'm going to bet you're going to feel that arm working harder than the arm that's curling. All right, we're going to stand up nice and tall. Abs are tight. One arm goes into that parallel position. The other arm is going to curl. Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six. Don't let your arm slide down. Seven, eight, two more. Last one here. Nice job. Bring both arms down. Opposite arm goes into that parallel position. Abs are tight. Let's curl. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Eight, two more. Last one. Nice job, bring both arms down. Let's rest it out. You can drop your weights if you want, shake out your arms. Hit pause to take a longer break. 
when you're ready. We're gonna do that again. Remember, keeping that arm that's parallel, keep it parallel. Don't let it slide down. All right, we're gonna do it again. Arm parallel, Ooh, let's curl. Up and squeeze, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, two more. Last one. Nice job, bring both arms down. Arm goes parallel. Let's go, curl. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Stay with me. Eight, two more. Last one. Nice job, bring both arms down. Let's rest it out. Now we're gonna do that one more time through, but let your arms recover. I'm sure they're getting tired. So take a minute here, hit pause, come back when you're ready. Standing up nice and tall, abs are tight. One arm's gonna go parallel, let's curl. One, two, Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, two more. Last one. Nice job, bring both arms down. Let's go parallel. Now curl, last time through, one, Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Two more. Last one. Let both arms come down. Nice job. I hope you enjoyed today's workout. If you did, give it a thumbs up, share it with a friend, and leave me a comment. And if you have a few extra minutes, check out the video in the corner. I'll see you in the next video.